I forgot to say good morning everyone I have a big problem that I love these places and these places is always always so chaotic and it's so hard to find a conversation here I love being here and I love just to leave the city and come to the nature but it's really so hard to find conversation here you know there's a lot of branches everywhere branches everywhere and there's a lot of small leaves big leaves and it's really so hard to find a conversation here but I'm always so happy to be here I, I like I like the smell of the nature the smell of the trees the smell of the leaves which are on the ground I'm really in love with that What I'm trying to capture today in this area I have actually more than one idea in my mind but I am trying to take a photo here as you can see um, the trees the trees are making like uh, natural trail or natu natural path and what I'm trying to search now I'm trying to search for the less chaotic path because there's a lot as I said there's a lot of a lot of chaos maybe this one work so there's like six or seven trails six or seven baths and I will search for maybe I so you can hear me again uh, as I said there's six or or seven ba uh, trails or, or paths natural paths because of the trees and I will try to take photos not only of one of them maybe I will try two or three and after going back home I will search for the less chaotic photo what I like about this photo is that as you can see if I came here the red and the yellow leaves on the trees here are really so so nice and I am hoping to be able to take a photo that the leaves the red and the yellow leaves here will be visible and will be like the main subject of the photo so I think I will like this photo the most there's two reasons number one is as you can see here there's um, there's nothing like small branch coming from the ground the ground is uh, somehow clean and what I was trying to do I was trying to make the photo a little bit symmetrical I will take the same photo again but now with polarizer so I will take off all the reflections from the leaves the orange leaves the yellow leaves and the red leaves which is which are the main subject of this photo that's why I want them to be totally clear and totally visible and no white spots or light reflections or anything like that Sometimes I really feel that the best invention in the humanity in terms of photography is the uh, polarizer filter. It's really so powerful. <laughs> Sorry. It's really so powerful, so amazing in places like this. It makes something that you can't do with Photoshop or with Lightroom. I, I really like it a lot. Um, I will show you the both photos right now how there was a lot of lights, a lot of ref reflections, I mean and those reflections are just uh, prevent the, the real color of the leaves that's why the leaves were just like white something white on the ground and not visible and these white spots i am pretty sure can't be controlled with shutter speed don't think that i have overexposed photo no no i just mean there's light reflection on the leaves and i am sure can't be controlled with lightroom photoshop or with the exposure speed or with the shutter speed so I think that's really very important I like it a lot I love you
I think I came more than five or six times in the past two months. I came to these specific two trees here. Why I like them? Because as you can see the background is black. I have a black background and at the same time I have light coming from upside and you feel like the leaves are glowing and there is more contrast on the leaves and the background is at the same time black and that gives beautiful contrast but I was something like half an hour ago just searching for a good composition or yeah, it's, it's not easy because I, I will not take with my ultra wide angle the ground is so, so chaotic I will try just to take photo for the branch or for the leaves believe it or not only to take a photo for some beautiful leaves I set up my tripod and I put my, the, the camera on and I put my polarizer uh, and why I did uh, why I did that because uh, uh, I wanted the leaves to be totally sharp I wanted to be sure that the leaves is sharp when I want to make it handheld with something like f2.8 maybe I will have a part of the leaf a part of the leaf uh, sharp and other part not be because you know I I can't be sure that I am taking the photo um, 90 degree exactly 90 degree on the leaf and I have more than one leaf at the same level and that's why it's hard to or it's impossible to make sure that all the leaves are sharp and if I want to go something like f6 or f uh, for example uh, seven eight um, i have to slow down my shutter speed and if i want to slow down my shutter speed i will have you know shake in the photo and that's why i obviously i use the tripod so here is another example of the power of using the CBL filter. Uh, I wanted actually to uh, to end the video but I saw this branch and this branch I they make me feel that they are making like a small door for this area. The sun is here behind the clouds but the cloud is not so heavy and that's why there's light and makes like I would say backlit for the leaves here and the trees are in the shade areas and the, li the light is coming from that direction I can zoom in more as you can see right here look to the grass here and the grass on the ground now you can say it's white and not totally green it's white this is without and with off on this is off and this is on So I will end the video right here and I just want to say thank you very much for your time, for your likes, comments, subscriptions and for your support. I want to say thank you for the four, four, for the all the subscribers and for anyone who is watching right now and decided to subscribe. Welcome and thank you very much. It's really so nice and I can't describe this feeling when you feel that there's people who are trained again, who are ready to see your content or to support your videos, support your photos. It's really, it's really so, so beautiful feeling. And I think this feeling, which always pushed me to go uh, and challenge myself to make photos that I didn't make before or to make uh, better videos or something like that. So, uh, thank you again. <laughs> And see you next Sunday. Oh, good morning, everyone. Maybe I will take the. Uh, 
there's two thing to to make the photo there was the <laughs> the leaves were what where maybe i maybe i i i um Hello, 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 hello,